Okay, today on Mike's Baseball Card Review, we'll have another episode of Attic Treasures, where I go through my cousin's baseball collection and look and see what he's got. And today I'll be looking at this binder that he had, and we'll see if he has any good cards in there. So let's just flip through here. We'll see we got the Top's Finest up here, where they have that shrink wrap around the cards. Um, that's kind of interesting. We had the EX, which I always thought was a pretty cool design. Um, that was a higher end set, if I recall. You only get a couple of uh, cards per pack. Um, so I know I didn't get a whole lot of those, but I did get one or two packs. We got a Greg Maddox here, that's nice. Cal Ripken Jr. Of course, these Collector's Choice Upper Deck were lower end cards, but um, we got some prospects there. Looks like a Derek Lee, so former Cub, I like that one. What else do we got here? We've got a Don Mattingly. Whoa, look at that right there. Michael Jordan, one-on-one. -on -one. That is a sweet card. Actually, I looked that up, and uh, it doesn't look like it's super valuable, but that is a card I would like to have. That is a sweet card. Michael Jordan, baseball card, is definitely on my wish list. Look at that Dream Team, Griffey Jr. That's pretty sweet. We got a Fleer 1990 Griffey. That's almost, it's just one year later. One year late on the rookie card. He's had an 89 rookie. Bagwell. So there's some good players in here. These pigs are starting to get a little bit stuck. He's got some color up here. Rookie Surge, Steve Traxel. I like these cards. These are cool looking cards. This is Bowman's Best. I remember early thinking Bowman's Best was really cool back in the day, too. I still like Bowman's Best. There's a Ryan Klesko, top prospect. Pinnacle, we've got Barry Bonds up there. Does that look like a uh, gold card right here? Tom Pagnosi? Tom Pagnosi? What is going on here? What is going on there? Look at that. That is crazy. I have no idea. I have no idea what's on that card. That doesn't appear to be in very <laughs> good condition there. You can barely see the card. That looks like a Barry Bonds, I think. It's a pretty sweet card of Ryan Klesko there. Platinum portraits. I like that. This Griffey, it's not in great condition if you see up top there. But that's a sweet picture, Griffey. Again, I don't know what in the world, what in the world is going on with some of these cards. There's a Cal Ripken, it's pretty sweet. Wow, there's a lot of Cal Ripkins up there. Look at that, boom, boom, boom. Cal Ripken, two, two Griffeys. We've got a lot of duplicates here. Chipper Jones, that's pretty awesome. Picture of a uh, Chipper there. Young Chipper. Uh oh. I think I missed a sleeve here. These are st sticking a little bit. Ben Davis. There's a Hideo Nomo. Star Trek. Oh, there's that Hideo Nomo uh, rookie card that we pulled in this uh, Tops Traded box not that long ago. So he must have pulled. Pulled that one out and brought it in. We got some of these predictor cards. So these were those, I think these were the insert cards in there. And it looks like um, we didn't do any, he didn't do any of the scratch offs there. Interesting. That's a sweet looking Mike Piazza. I like these cards. Look at that, they're showing the, uh, how you hold the ball for the certain pitches on these pitchers. There's Greg Maddox there. I am really digging these cards. These are some pretty cool looking cards. I'm liking it. There's that metal. Uh, I think it's like Fleer metal cards. Those were kind of kind of crazy looking cards. There. Some more metal. The Mark McGuire. John Smoltz. Ray Sanchez, Ray Sanchez, 
Not a great player, but I remember that, Cubby. Some more metal. See anybody good? Not so much there. Got a Roger Clemens. Tim Salmon. More metal. So he, he liked the metal, it looks like. At least he had a, a decent amount of metal cards here. Definitely more than I had. I might have got a pack or two of metal, but that was about it. Look at that. Heavy metal. We got a Sammy Sosa. Okay, so that wraps up this episode of Attic Treasures. Le leave a comment and let me know what you think. What was your favorite card in this binder? For me, it was definitely, I think, the Michael Jordan one-on-one -on -one card. Uh, I was a huge Michael Jordan fan. So leave a comment. I'd love to hear what you have to say and what you think about these videos. Thanks, everybody. Take care.